Hello guys, Igor here doing one more episode more review. Today analyzing Tixu, a tool that claims to create, organize, and share information with your team from one centralized workspace. This deal is pretty interesting, unique, and different. I just tried it and I bought the tier one and you may think that you are dealing with a project management tool but it's not like that it's a collaborative workspace that you can create many boards and then you can just tackle it to uh help you to share your information and to get to know uh, wh what you are working about, what's going on with your daily entrepreneur life. A unique tool. You can build internal uh, knowledge base. You can create go-to page. You can organize files. Pretty interesting. I bought the tier one and I'm excited to show the tool for you. Let's see how the tool, how the deal works. First thing that I want to say is that everyone gets the same plan. That's uh, is their team plan, uh, which is a good plan, uh, one of the their best tiers. And you don't need to stack to get the features of the team plan. So you're going to get the team plan with the license tier one, about tier one, 10 users, members are good for me. But you can um, upgrade the tiers and go up to tier four, where you're going to get 100 users. That's a lot. You can create a whole, um, can run a whole enterprise with a hundred users in Tixio. So you don't need to stack to get new features with tier one. You're good to go. I bought so tier one. Let's take a look at the tool. Oh, here is my Tixio dashboard. You can see that on your workspace settings, you can add your upload photo. You can add your subdomain and you will be able to add a custom domain. So the tool will be uh, will have the white label and it will be available for Zoom links. On your workspace settings as well is where you're going to invite your members. Just go here and type the email address. You can divide your members by group. It's a features as well. But now let's see how the tool works. This welcome board, it's an example of board. You're going to see the Tixel board for the first time here on the welcome board. And here you can see the different kind of widgets that you can create. Tixel works with widgets. You create widgets and then uh, with those widgets, you're gonna create your board. On the marketing tasks, you can see that you have a, a more complex text. And here, the text for today, a simple task. On simple task, you just create a new task here, create a task and you'll be able uh, to have your Pomodoro here inside Tixel. You need to fill out when you are done. You can even delete it. So you can create a task for today. You have a Pomodoro here inside Tixio. On marketing text, there are more complex texts where you can assign users for that text. You can change the status, review, working on it. You can add the labels in the way that you want, set the deadline and the priority of each text. You can create also a text to, uh, which is to write your notes, okay, inside your board. So it's pretty simple, write your notes here. For instance, bold it, nice features for the note. Those widgets here are the bookmark widget. So you can just the link you want and it will convert automatically to a bookmark. Let's create a new widget, a, a new board. I'm going to delete this one. Let's create a new board where we can see all the, the boards. So here is my board, my new board. I'm going to give it a name and you can see that we have one, two, three, four, five, six different kind of widget. The bookmark widget, the checklist, advanced tasks, simple notes, RSS feed, and web page. On the bookmark feature, you can add, you can share with people or only for you to get to know the links you are using on your entrepreneur project. Just type the link and click on OK, and it's done. You can also configure your links in many ways. You can hide the icon, hide the header, you can show the uh, bookmarks, details, you can change the size, you can show as an icon like that, changing the size as well. So those are the bookmarks. You can create new widgets, for instance, a checklist. So here's the checklist, just create and it's done. New task two, finish the task, just click here and you can even delete it. You can use that, for instance, to be your Pomodoro. Another widget is the advanced tasks that you can use to create 
task, it's going to assign someone and add a different st status and deadline and priority. You can move those widgets the way that you want and organize it. There is also the simple notes. You can use that widget to write your daily notes about a topic. Also, there is the RSS feeds. You can add your blog here, your blog feed here, and then your feed will show up with all the new uh, blog posts. This feature would be interesting. You can create different RSS feeds with the websites that you want to check it out daily, and then you can just use Tixu to see all the feeds together. You can also add a web page. Just add the link of the website and add the widget and browse websites inside. Okay. So those are the boards. I'm going to delete that one. You have also a wiki where you can add cover image, create pages and notes. You can add headings, bullet list, hints, codes, table, numbered list, checklist, code snippets, embed, mention, catch, empty space, well, and separator to create web page. Also, you can use templates, new wikis, new page. Right now they have one, two, three, four, more than 12 templates. For instance, for the sake of that review, I'm going to show you the meeting minutes. I'm going to use that one. You can see here a complete template for your meet me, uh, minutes. You can also create your own template. You can share your browse and also your wikis. You just need to click on share and create a link. Anyone with that link can see your web page. This is a web page created on Tixio. Also, you can use Tixio to organize your drives. You can connect all your drives here. Now they have Google integration, Dropbox, and OneDrive. So you can connect your drives. You can even connect to Google drives and search your files inside Tixio. Your files will be here, as you can see. You can use your search uh, to any articles, any files, any kind of words. You also can check out all the templates and you can find anything on Tixio using their search method. So this is Tixio. I hope you like that review. I think that to is unique, I'm going to use it to create unique boards and then share with my students with crucial informations about some lessons that I make that I'm making. So I think Chixo has many use cases. The deal is pretty good. You can get everything with license tier one. So get it. If you like that review, please click on the link in the description to help me to keep going. There you will find the best price for Chixio. Thanks so much. Bye bye.